Basically, our module is a all fully brake form module. Everything is fully welded, one part attaching to another. Alan, what are some of the, the benefits of brake form constructed versus extruded? Strength, you got weight, lighter weight. Okay. And when you put it all together, you have a box that's actually stronger than an extruded box. Stronger yet lighter, so we're actually making the chassis perform longer because if it's a lighter weight unit. Talk about our arched roof and some of the advantages of our arched roof. The arch to our roof is one of our major points. That increases the strength of our module greatly. And again, the roof is full seam welded on the exterior, across the back, the top, and the interior is stitch welded at various structural points. When a unit comes in from the weld shop, it heads to the body area. We grind all the welds, door corners. Uh, then it goes into the foam area. We foam the unit inside and underneath uh, for sound denting, insulation purposes. From there, it heads into a wash station. We degrease the exterior, send it to a bake cycle in a booth, bake it uh, for a period of 30 minutes. At that time, it goes back to the body area. Uh, we proceed to body fill all the seams, wall penetrations, anything on the exterior, and uh, finish it up there. At that time, it heads into the booth. We roll on a coat of uh, filler primer, uh, bring it back to the paint shop. It gets baked again for another 30 minutes. It's back into the body shop. We sand the exterior of it. Uh, at that time, we take it back into the booth. We prime it completely with at least three coats of primer. At that time it heads back to the paint shop, gets baked out for another 30 minutes. Back to the body shop, we do our final sanding on it. Uh, at that time we caulk all the corners, uh, interior, exterior of the cabinets. At that time we send it back to the paint shop as a completed unit ready to prime. As you can see, we have one in the booth here that's ready to be painted. This is in final prime, interior is primed white for our interior coating on our aluminum cabinets. Uh, we will spray it with at least three coats of paint, three coats of clear. That time we will bake it for 40 minutes. And it comes out, heads back to our body shop. We do a trim guard coating on the compartment area. We do an interior lining called Zolotone, clear coat. Uh, at that time it goes into the buff station. We buff the exterior, get it all polished up, then it returns into production. This is where we strategically place our wire harnessing and PDQ installation. Our power distribution quarters is where we have our Master Tech 3 multiplex electrical system. The Master Tech 3 true peer-to-peer -peer multiplex electrical system reduces downtime with the self-diagnostics feature and eliminates mechanical parts which have a high failure rate. This system is a proven electrical system with over nine years in the field and over 2,000 units in service. Our next steps in the production process are chassis prep and module mount. Chassis prep is the process where we prepare the chassis with grill and intersection lights, heat and AC tie-in points, air horns and siren speakers, and outriggers and an air ride if needed. Whether it be a type one or type three chassis, we fully prepare the chassis to marry up with the module at box mount. And with me I have Mark Slusher, our graphics engineer. We offer a turnkey application when it comes to our graphics. During the pre-construction meeting, you can come in, sit down with Mark, and we'll actually lay out and design your paint scheme, your graphics, and your lettering. Have a digital print of it done, and then we will actually apply it so when the ambulance is complete, it's ready to go into operation.